So does anyone remember these two shows to do what would happen and destroy build destroyed? Because we do. These crazy shows was a part of the Cartoon Network Real Block, which aired in the summer of 2009. The Cartoon Network Real Block included shows like Do What Would Happen, Destroy Build Destroy, Tower Prep, Out of Jimmy's Head, Brain Rush, etc. But for today, me and Patrick are going to talk about the two shows, Destroy Build Destroy, and Do What Would Happen. But first, my name's Herman. And I'm Patrick. And you're, and you're watching, watching The Vision. Vision. Now do what would happen. Now do what would happen was about three friends, CJ, Jackson, and Ollie, who in every episode would come up with some crazy ideas and try to execute said idea. Crazy ideas like Dude, what would happen if we had a limo demolition derby at the prom? And what would happen if Ollie tried to lead a camel to the top of a dune? These guys were totally awesome and rad and just plain nuclear, dude. There really wasn't much to the show. It was three idiots performing crazy and wild stunts in each episode. They would do three stunts a day. Looking back, they were not as crazy as some may think. Like, at all. Like, for example, in one episode, they're all like, Dude, what would happen if we race a boat in a car? Dude, what would happen if we raced a car versus a boat? <laughs> and they're all excited, like, dude, this is gonna be awesome! Oh my god, I can't believe we're doing this, we're so edgy and cool! <laughs> in one episode, they got an old trailer, and then they put popcorn in it, because, dude, what would happen if you tried to make popcorn in the trailer using a flamethrower? Jesus, seriously guys, lock your girlfriends away, because these guys might steal them. I've never been so excited to hear popcorn pop in my life. It was like success. We did it, guys. Pop it! Okay. Pop it! Queen butter! Queen butter! Queen butter. Pop Never mind. Gosh, you taking girlfriend after Trump. Let's be honest. These guards are like the faces of the show. They got paid to say, dude, what would happen? Yeah, as I got older, I started to realize these guys acting freaking sucks. It's painfully obvious that the ideas are just part of a script. But dude, what would happen if the show was actually good? Or dude, what would happen if Cartoon Network aired cartoons instead of live action shows? The same shit that happened when Mandy smiled. What would happen if Cartoon Network aired cartoons instead of live action shows? Live action shows. Live action shows. Live action shows. With the natural order! But nothing was worse than destroy, build, destroy. Bro, wait, bro, it wasn't that bad. My little 10 year old heart was content with seeing Michael Bay explosions every week. Now that I think of it, that's all the show was two different groups of kids blowing shit up, fixing it to complete challenge. Jizz. God, fuck Patrick. Fixing it to complete a challenge. And then blowing up the losers. So, oh, and then, okay, fuck. Jesus, Patrick. Fixing it to complete a challenge and then blowing up the losers' so called invention. You actually like this show? I thought this show was lame as hell. Cartoon Network tried to do something different with this C and Real Block shit. But what I don't think they understood was that they weren't Nickelodeon or hell, even Disney. They were Cartoon Network, a network dedicated to cartoons. I can understand if when they first started to air on TV, they had some real life shows, but they didn't. At that point, Cartoon Network was known for their cartoons. I don't know how many times I've said it. Maybe they were trying to compete with Nick and Disney. Nickelodeon had the sets of Drake and Josh, and Disney had the sets of just about anything they put out. Yeah, you got a point there. Maybe they were trying to compete with the live action shows Nick and Disney were putting out. But you can't lie. The explosions were lit. Literally. <laughs> but no, land jokes aside, I have nothing bad to say about this show. I knew what it was and it appealed to me as a kid because I was a young boy. I just like watching shit blow the fuck up. 